that, I'll just give you a one minute a description of, of what we do. We are a, a slightly unusual organization in being a, an endowment, a foundation, originally funded from gambling money, uh, the lottery. Uh, and we've evolved, I mean, our title means National Endowment for Science, Technology and the Arts. And we've evolved into a mix of roles which overlap a lot with what you guys do. We have a, essentially a venture capital team who do commercial investments, early stage companies, fund seed funds, accelerators, etc. We have a research team that uh, Kirst is part of, which mainly studies how innovation is done around the world. We have statistical tools, big program now using new tools, data scraping, mining, to understand, you know, dynamics of, of business creation and so on, uh, and also looking at how, where 100 years ago innovation meant learning from Germany, and maybe 30 years ago everywhere wanted to copy, copy Silicon Valley, how do we actually have a truly global conversation where we understand the methods coming from <laughs> India, or from uh, Brazil, or a, a brilliant report Kirsten published a couple of weeks ago in Beijing, what's the Chinese innovation system, what's different about it? from Europe and North America. And then we have programs where we run things more like, I think some of what you're going to be doing in, in Bihar, structured programs of innovation in healthcare, in education, in jobs, often working in partnership with the government. We have a joint team with the UK Cabinet Office, for example, on innovations in mobilizing public time and energy for public services. Uh, and uh, a lot on digital um, learning for kids. Uh, and 